Hey guys, Joe Burnich here with BigWestMarketing.com. Quick little tip for all of our current clients who we have created WordPress websites for. Um, we seem to be having uh, some miscommunication on what you should or shouldn't do once you get your admin information. So we'll send you a username and password so you have full control over your website and you can go in there and do you know create pages you know change pages all that kind of stuff but what we've been having lately is people um, kind of clicking around and doing things that are breaking their websites so i want to kind of go over the do's and don'ts of websites for our current clients right now so let's uh let's go into the wordpress dashboard i've already got logged in and everything so here's typically what you're gonna see when you log into a, uh, a wordpress website something similar to this okay Along the left-hand side, I'm gonna scooch this over here. On the long left-hand side, we've got posts. If you're doing blog posts, that's fine. You can use this feature. Media, that's where you add pictures to your website if you need to. Links, I wouldn't worry about links at all. Pages, that's another one where you should you sh you should uh, go in there and add new pages or um, edit pages that you currently have. So let's click on pages, for example. This should be the number one thing. Let's say that I want to go in and I want to change the About Us page. I'm going to click Edit here. And it's similar to like Microsoft Word. You're going to have your content here, and you can change the wording around, and you can make it bold. I can make the word superior bold if I wanted to. Uh, stuff like that. You know, if I wanted to add a link to another website, I can go Healthy Indoor Environment, highlight that, click on Link, and then I can put the website address right there. I'm not going to do it right now but um, that's just something that you can do and then and then of course you want to save it before the changes go live or publish it or update it so that's great if you want to make content changes but the problems we've been having lately uh, is people are going into like the plugins area here let me leave this page now the plugins that we use on our websites um, are very we're very very strategic and careful which plugins we include and which plugins we don't include on a website because plugins are the number one reason that websites get hacked. You can get all these free different plugins that make your websites do all these cool little things, but some websites will conflict with each other. They'll conflict with new WordPress updates which come out monthly. They will uh, be written by programmers who don't know anything about security or don't pay attention to security and hacking and stuff like that. We just had a website hacked last week, and it turns out it was because of some strange plugin that we had never heard of. Like we do extensive research and testing on all on any plugin before we put it onto a WordPress site. So it's important, and and every single plugin we have that's active, uh, there's a specific reason that we have it on there. Okay, so like for example, the video embedder, we want to make sure that your YouTube videos show up on cell phones, smartphones, not just desktops. So that's why we have that plugin on there. Backup Buddy, we want to be able to make backups of your website. Um, and then let's see, Contact Form 7, that's for the contact form on your website, for, so people can get free estimates and, and stuff like that. We disable comments because people can spam your website to death with comments if, you don't, if we don't disable that, so we have a plugin for that. Um, this helps with email sending, uh, login lockdown, so that people can't just do unlimited passwords and, and stuff. They only get like five chances to log in your website or they get locked out. So that's an important one. Uh, the managed WP worker lets us do security updates. So most of these are for security to keep your website safe. Um, easy five star, if you're using that, it's to, to um, get reviews for your Google and Yelp page. Hopefully, you won't need this plugin now that we've come out with our app version, our, our smartphone version that does a text instead of an email, which is 10 times easier. Um, but all this stuff is, is strategically placed on your website for a reason. And if you deactivate any of these or go in and start messing with the settings, chances are you're going to break your website and then you're going to want us to fix it, which is fine. Um, if it's a big problem, it's going to cost extra money. If it's a small fix, it's no problem. But we can't just get to it, you know, the second that you need it, typically, because we've got a lot of stuff going on, um, and we can't just stop everything we're doing to to fix a problem um, because a, a setting was changed or something like that. I'm sure you guys understand what I'm talking about. Um, and we don't want any downtime on your website too. You know, we don't want you to lose business because of a setting. So what you can do if you absolutely feel like you need to add a new plugin 
or change the setting in a plugin, or if you're just curious about it, please call or email us. Uh, you know, because then we will be able to uh, give you advice or maybe just do something for you if it's easier that way. Um, but it depends. Now, if you really, really want to get crazy and uh, learn how WordPress works and you want to do more than just edit pages and, and stuff like that, then there's lots of uh, tutorials out there. I came out with one that is based on how I do web design or how we do web design here at Big West Marketing. Um, if you'll get a full, if you want to join the Big West Academy .com, um, it's basically just a course that includes uh, all the um, all the step by step video tutorials, training on how to create your own WordPress website from scratch, how to create, how to add plugins, test plugins, themes, everything you see along the side here, we go over, and more. Okay, and we even tell you how to set up hosting and all that stuff. So if you really want to get into the website stuff, if that's just fun for you and you really want to learn it without breaking your website, uh, then then sign up for BigWestAcademy.com. Okay, and you'll also learn how to do Facebook ads. You'll learn how to do SEO, get your Google your uh, site ranked up on Google. Basically, it's everything we know put into like videos for you guys, uh, step by step tutorials, just as if you're looking over my shoulder watching me do that. Once again, that's Big West Market. Uh, I'm sorry, the Big West Academy.com, and I am Joe Burnich with Big West Marketing.com. Thank you for watching. Let us know if you have any questions. Um, I, I really appreciate every. I appreciate all of our clients, and I really want to help you guys. I just don't want you to ha your site to go down. I just don't want you guys to have site problems for. Uh, for something that we could have easily uh, taken care of um, prior. So that's it well, on this little rant, this little uh, informational video. Once again, my name is Joe Burnich, and I will talk to you soon.